every year in the beginning of June, we lived in Bristol and the farmer would come up with his car. And when you saw that car there, you knew it was Peepikin time and you'd be excited. And then we drive down and I thought we was going hundreds and hundreds of miles. But we'll come to it, it was only about 40 miles. And uh, the farmer had put me dad's spot out. He'd put Jack, he called me dad Jack. And there'd be a piece of board and it'd say Jack's plot. And we'd pull in there, all people that we knew, you know. And we used to, when we was really small, like we'd just play all day, make houses at the PM. And as you got a little bit older, you just sort of pick. And you'd pick your peas, you pick them in your welly, you pick them in a bowl. And then you tip them in the bag, and then you get a bag full, and your dad'd have to carry them because she wasn't big enough to carry them. Weigh them in, and you'd go to the scales, and there'd be a queue, and you'd get your overweights. And if you had overweights, you'd be happy because you had to start to your other bag then, didn't you? And they'd stop about nine o'clock for breakfast, and all the men would go and get the wood, come back and make a fire, and you could smell the smoke, and you'd be starving. And your mum would go back, put the pan on, and you could smell the eggs and bacon. You go back and have a good breakfast, a nice big pot of tea, and then you'd go back and you start again, pick and pick, pick until dinner time, and then the smoke would go again. You'd all pick, you'd all pick side by side in the beginning, all start side by side, mums, dads, kids. But then as the kids got older, you know, about 13, 14, you didn't want to be with your mum and dad, did you? So you'd all, so all the young ones, they'd go over the far end of the field, and we'd all pick together and have a chat together and carry our peas and scales together. And then uh, at the end of the day, you go home, you do a bit of cleaning up, and then you'd all meet up, the kids, the young ones, having a chat at night times, doing a bit of courting. Uh, weekends, you look forward to the weekends. You go at yeah, your wages, go to the pictures, come back, and all the only the young ones and the fathers went on a Sunday morning, picking peas. Mum would stay home and cook the dinner. It was work, we were doing it for money. But when you were young, it wasn't work. It was the highlight of your life, the best times of your life, <laughs> if you can put it that way.